Hello everyone, and welcome back to Gate of Providence. Um, I did a little bit of, like, grinding off-screen, so I have a little bit more gold. I have a lot more, um... Oops. I have, like, a lot more materials now, which is kind of cool. And you might notice I have a lot more fish as well. I tried to do that little minigame, or that mission where you go around and catch one of each of the fish. However, um, the fishing spots I found just, like, inherently would not give me, like, certain kinds of fish, at least it looked like. I mean, um... What I mean by that is, like, like for example, I think at the places that were supposed to give you base, or bass, dang it, <laughs> um, I think at the places that were supposed to give me, like, river fish, they would only give me one kind of fish, whatever that one fish is here. Like, for example, cave fish, this is an easy one to, um, this is an easy one to explain. When I went to a cave, there are two fish you can find in the cave, the cave fish and the eel. I was only getting cave fish, and I tried fishing, like, 40 times. And it was like this for pretty much all of the fishing spots where I was still missing fish, which is super weird. So I'm just going to assume that you can only find these later in the game. Uh, secondly, I got as I ran into this screen, I got an achievement called, like, In the Long Run. Let me see if I can find it real quick. I'm assuming that's for, like, playing the game for an arbitrary amount of time. That's typical. That, that's kind of what it sounded like. Uh, right here. Walk. Oh, walk 30,000 steps. Okay, that's cool. Also, um... From the cat, I got, um, I got the lucid ring. Where is immune to confusion? The cat just randomly brought this back during one of her trips. And got some more gold. Okay, cool. I'm starting to get kind of addicted to this cat. Um, I do not have cod. Um, I'm starting to get a little addicted to this, um, <laughs> to this cat mechanic, actually. This is kind of cool. Um, okay. Here we go. Training. Adventuring. Oh, I also unlocked the um the way of the leopard. So that's kind of cool. All right, sweet. So apparently I am an idiot because um I I completely forgot where I was supposed to go last time, if you remember. And um apparently uh, now I I think I got confused by this because um because like that way opened up and I thought I was supposed to go that way, but no, apparently you're supposed to go up this way, back to the castle area. And the reason why, like, when they said Remnants of Area, I thought it was, like, a place farther up, but no, apparently you just need to talk to this guy again. Let's go into the city. Ready? Yes. Here's the plan. Providence defenses in South Area is weak. Compromise, um, comprised of mostly assassins. They should be no match for Pascal and the Brutes, who will, uh, who will then open the city's gate. This shall allow our, our reinforcements to pour into the city and capture South Area. While this happens, you two will enter the, the district building and uh, defeat e Elena. Got it. Let's go. Yeah, I kind of assumed that it was going to be in a, um, like, um, okay, I, I might as well be a little blunt about this. One thing about medieval games that always frustrate me is that I have a hard time memorizing, like, the area names. So whenever they bring up an area, I always just sort of assume that it's, like, the next area coming up, if that makes sense. Even during Providence Occupation, the inn stayed open. That's pretty hardcore. And this is true for, like, every RPG as well. I, like, I'm so used to just going forward. Like, tunnel vision forward and nothing else. They won't get past us. We'll keep watch for, uh, from this side. Take uh, take the other path. Okay. It's good to know he's on our side. If you are interested in blacksmithing, come check out the Blacksmith Guild in Uxerion. I think I've done that, actually. And Pascal's castle we already um, went through. Thankfully, other Providence members have fled from this district. Those fools scatter without their little buddies backing them up. I've decided that uh, the hunting life the hunting life is not for me, so I'm staying here in area. People are already coming out of their homes. Let's keep them safe. Well then, best leave them alone. Well, what what are they doing? Um, is this place open yet? It looks like it is. Welcome. What would you like to order? Oh, cool. So another place to buy these. I wonder if um, this place is tied to the last food area, like you have to upgrade that in order to get these, because I can kind of see the game doing that. Also, I just noticed this, look in the top left, it looks like these uh, these food items have cooldowns as well. That's actually kind of smart, um, not only because it's a little more realistic in a way that is not intrusive, but it also encourages you to buy multiple types of food, as opposed to just guzzling down the same steak over and over again. That's actually... <laughs> I love how he says on a diet when you don't buy anything. That's funny. <laughs> That's actually really smart. I think that building was abandoned. Also, I feel I'm a little too close to the mic. One moment. 
There we go. Looks like that hole won't, uh, won't be fixed for a long time. So I'll blow a hole out of this building and, and out of the building and buildings in the district. I wonder why. Those damn Providence people tried to arrest me and my friend yesterday. I hope they uh, they managed to get away. So Prince Tal is the leader of Providence. I heard Prince T uh, Tavis is leading some sort of resistance movement. Nothing like a good drink after a workout. Do you like Hanoi steak? Sure. Yeah, how do you like it? Burnt to a crisp or bloody and bloody as hell? Um... Honestly, in real life, I'm more a fan of the middle option, but I'll go for this one. Hell yeah, the right way to eat it. Have some of this. Oh, cool. Good stuff. Enjoy it. You know, it's kind of... I've heard this sort of like a running joke now. Or I've heard this sort of a running joke for where, um... Where, like, women love their, their steak well done, like, really well done, and men love their steak really, really rare. Though, frankly, I don't get that. Like, I swear I've heard that before, but I, I don't understand it, because in my... From my experience, it's actually the opposite. Any time of the day is a good time for pie. Glad I can finally eat here again. The cake here is delicious. It's got strawberries grown from sake. Okay, cool. They won't be able to recapture the district. We'll keep the district safe. I probably need to talk to, like, one of these guys up here in order to actually move on here. Yep, here we go. Great, you're here. Time to get started. Go, go, go! Create, uh, create an opening for June and Nell. Yes, sir. I want to fight those guys. We'll try to get the gate open. Head to the district building. We'll hang all these fools. Okay, wait. Oh, okay, I was gonna say they look exactly the same, but no, their hair colors are different. Oh, I forgot about this mechanic. Let's just fight. This is a lady fighter. Skilled guard. Okay, you're new. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to be extremely overleveled. Yeah, look at that. That did, like, no damage. Because I, you know, I, I'm doing, like, all the missions before I do anything. Oh, wow. That was really pathetic, and I think it was my fault. <laughs> it's, we'll keep watch from this side. Take out the other path. I think you're a different color. Any last words? That's my line. Tranquil Blades. Oh, that put me to sleep. Okay. That's different. And Derulium. Oh, jeez. Okay, these guys don't mess around. Um, Wait, wait, that's a group hit. I don't want to use that. Okay, good. That's probably locked. There's a note on the door. The pub is closed for now. This is as far as you'll go. And two of these soldiers. I'm gonna use this. No, 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 no. Not yet. That hurt her and gave her debuffs. What was that? I actually didn't catch what the name of that um, that skill was. Okay, but you're probably super dangerous right now, so we'll kill you. Uh, you don't need health. Power potion. Hmm. You know, given that it's a potion, I can't help but wonder if that's supposed to deal damage or not. This should kill. Just barely, actually. Provided deep cut. I defeat you of normal attacks. Oh, okay. I can't wait until I sink these daggers into you.
not now. There's no on the door. Closed due to Providence. The restaurant is closed. Someone out there? Sorry, it's too dangerous to do business in this district right now. There might be Providence members watching. Come back later. Okay. Oh, is that a ring shop? I want to go in there. Area under Providence control. Closed until further notice. This city belongs to Providence. What does this do again? Oh, okay. That was called like Providence Deep Cut or something. Also, I should be using this. Is that intentional? I need to know. Like, are, are, they, are the power potions supposed to do damage to them? Because that, that kind of feels a little off somehow. I really don't know why. It just kind of does. I can't heal you. It was just a normal attack to do it. I wonder if I can get another level up before I uh, do the next boss. I feel like I could, like, realistically. Also, I feel like I should heal June right now. You're not the one with the draining skill, though. Yeah, just go ahead and do that. Did she not attack? Oh no, no, she put some sort of buff on herself. Okay. Ooh, oh, that hit both of us. Normal attacks might be able to do it, but I'll, I'll play it safe and just do it. You're guarding? She wasn't out of, um, anima points, so I kind of wonder what that was about. Huh. There's no on the door. Close due to province control, come back later. Okay. Die. You will. <laughs> it's... sure. Sweet. Oh, there's a shortcut around. Also, I feel like there should be a chest here. I remember there was a chest um on the other side of this town. Oh, we got another one of these. Okay. I have a feeling that there's no turning back once we go in. Hold up. Uh, just go ahead and save real quick. Oh, wait, wait. This is the one where... <laughs> I'm playing another game right now where you can save on the other world, so I'm a little confused. Oh, what's this? One, five, three, five. Oh, I know what this is. Okay, that lowers the number by four. That lowers the number by two. And that lowers the number by one. I'm assuming I need to make it zero. Yep, okay. I'm also kind of curious. What happens if I... Oh, okay. Yo, I love these sorts of puzzles. So that one's a seven. That lowers it by eight. I'm gonna assume some of these switches add to the number then. That lowers it by four. That lowers it by two. That lowers it by one. Oh, hold up. Oh wait, no, I did my math wrong. There we go. 53! Oh wow, this one might take a while. I can't do mental math that quickly. I want to know what if any of these raise the number. That one, that one's two, that one's easy. 
That one does one. That one does two. Oh, these are incremental. This one lowers it the most, that one lowers it the least. Okay, so what I probably need to do is I probably need to... Oh, wait, I got it. I That one did not take as long as I thought it would. <laughs> 218. Okay, that brings it down to 90. That brings it down by one. Okay, so it's probably the exact same thing. That overflows it. Yep, okay. Assassin key. Oh, hi. It's simple. You die, the Lord Tao will be pleased. Hmm, okay, so three of them. I want to use this. I feel like it'll really cripple them. Oh, that's set him on fire, too. Nice. Uh, you're asleep again. I'm gonna put this up. What was that? Okay. Hmm. Oh, this is one of those games where being attacked wakes you up. Okay, that's that's good to know. I kind of want to save up for that. I think the these two attacks combined will. Oh, okay. I didn't need to need to do that. Okay, that got rid of the generation. I'm gonna use that again. And, uh, you use the sun. That's gonna bring you down to zero, though. Uh oh. Oh, that's not good. I don't think a normal attack is going to kill you. I'm going to use this. Okay, you're woken up. This should do it. Okay, cool. We're almost at full health, too, after that. Oh, it's you. Did you come here to die? No, we're here to take, uh, to take you back, Elena. Let's do this. Alright, we got another boss! For boss time! <laughs> it's... That is a weird pose she's in. <laughs> okay, let's start this. Oh wait, do I have an item on me? Um, nothing crit- I could do that. Hmm. No, I have other things I can cast, please. Let's start by doing this. I want to debuff her as much as possible. I don't need to do that if I'm, uh, yeah, if I'm draining, uh, Anima. You're at nearly full, so I'll just use this. Anima si- Oh! Okay, so she has two things that can boost Anima. I might need to use that, uh, okay. I still want to take all your Anima away. Light Blade. Oh, that's a buff, not an attack. I'm assuming that just, like, boosts attacks and maybe adds a buff? 
Or maybe adds, like, light element? Elements haven't really been a mechanic in this game, though. I kind of wonder what that's supposed to mean. Huh. Okay. You're out of anima, so I don't have to worry for this turn, at least. Unless the light blade thing allows you to bypass that, which would actually be kind of a cool status ailment. Stunned you. That's a critical hit? Oh, we're good. We got this. Hallowed Slash. He now she put up Ailment Guard. I'm assuming that makes you immune to status ailments. This is a cool fight. And she can heal herself! <laughs> huh, that was a cool one. I, I kind of think that one was a little too easy, but yeah, that I like that. <laughs> oh, I just barely got a level for that. Ugh, oh, what skill? All right, the Faith Devol uh, Devourer. On it. Here it comes. What's happening? Mama, Papa. Wake up. We need to go. Oh, oh, is this the girl um, whose house we burned down? Wake up. No. No. What's this? The sword. I've seen it before. It belongs to the... Uh, to the Aristocracy. The aristocracy, they will pay for this. I'm I'll make them pay. All your little buddies are dead. Do you know this sword? This is the sword that you scum killed my parents with. Please, have mercy. What um what is it you want? Money, power? I can get you a seat in the Council of Lords. I can make sure you will live uh, like a noble for the rest of your life. Please forgive me. Ask for forgiveness with for my parents who you killed. But it's already too late. You are already dead. What? At last. Everyone involved with, the, with my parents' murder is dead. Elena, you have proven your skills uh, to the Order. I have an assignment of utmost importance to you. What is it, Grandmaster? Head west of the co uh, continents of Iris and stop the growing threat of the organization known as Providence. I'll live the leader, Tal. Roland and Miranda shall accompany you on this task. I, I ensure, it to, ensure it be done. For the world's balance. For the world's balance. Of the start look familiar. Elena, hold up! What? Nell. What are you doing here? I'm coming to, with you to Iris. I've got a bad feeling I just can't shake off. Oh, don't worry about me. But if you insist, you can keep me company during the trip. Ooh. That must be Tal. The world's balance. Uh-oh. What? I can't move. We've got a sneaky one here. My, that's quite impressive. Finding our, uh, finding our hidden chamber and sneaking so close to us. If it wasn't for Raphael, you might have even been able to kill me. Those garments suggest that she's, a, of a, she's an Eastern assassin. Oh, an Eastern assassin? It's too bad you don't know how um, Iversian magic works. Raphael has been here the whole time. You'll be an asset to us. Avandius, bind her. Ugh. Ugh. Elena, Elena. Nell. Did you miss me? Damn right I did. What have uh, they done? Yeah, what they've done and made me do. They won't get away with this. Then join us. The remnants of area. I'm destroying Providence. Of course. We need to. Uh, we need. What needs to be done? Head for the old temple south of here on per, um, Perennia Road and talk to Prince Man, Prince uh, Prince Tavis. All right, I'm going now. Oh, and take these. Moonlit Shroud. After acquiring the Moonlit Shroud, you gain the ability to warp between. Fast travel! <laughs> if the statue is blue, the statue is a warp source and a warp destination. If the statue is yellow, the statue is a warp source. If the statue is purple, the statue does not have warping capabilities. Oh, that's kind of cool. Huh. So blue statues are what I should be working for, or w looking for. Alright, cool. So now, what will you do, what will you do now? 
What are you talking about? You saved Elena already. Are you kidding? I'm going to see, see this through, to the very end. After all, we make a great team. Of course. Alright, cool. Oh, that's it? Okay. I always think they're going to warp us back for some reason, because it always takes a while to get back to um, the original area. Someone out there? Sorry, it's too dangerous. Oh, okay. We, stand, we still can't do these. Looks like this is all we can do for now. Wait, who's that guy? The guy right next to the door. Sorry, sir. We are still working to get that gate open. Report back to Tavis for now. We'll have it open by then. Oh, okay. Fair enough. <laughs> They're still there. So is this game structured in a way in which, like, every chapter we're going to come back here for some reason? That's actually kind of an interesting idea. Looks like we have to go back to Tavis now. Oh, wait! Warp! Let's warp there. Looks like we have to memorize what these places are actually now. Hold up, hold up. I want to go back to my cat first. Area, Rania, I think Saki is the town. I gotta memorize these town names now. Yeah, it is. That little fade right there, I'm assuming what that is is that's the cat warping back in. I can attend the next path in 137 experience. Here's what I brought back for my adventure. Gauntlets of Power! Oh my goodness, cat, what have you been up to? Wait, that's an accessory probably. A pair of gauntlets that increase the wearer's strength. Hold up. Huh, interesting. It looks like this raises attack just as much as this one do. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll put that back on. That's actually not a good item. <laughs> the Craving Pike. I don't have Pike. Oh, is that what the green text is? That's smart. Uh, I'm gonna keep giving you uh, ass for now. Training, adventure, the leopard. I'll bring back something for my adventures. Cool. I, I'm loving the system so far. If this game was more popular, I would love to see, like, a chart of, like, what you can and cannot get from, uh, from that cat. Also, I sort of wonder if that, if that cat works in real time or not. I, like, if I close the game, then come back 15 minutes later, will the cat be back? Or is it 15, ga uh, 15 minutes in-game time? I, I should experiment with this, actually, because I, I want to see what you can do with that cat once uh, once she gets uh, high enough a level. Excellent work. Elena has joined us, and the, mark and the market district has been liberated. There are now two more districts to liberate. Please rest for the day. You've earned it. At night? Elena. Oh, these two are love interests, yeah. Talk to me. What's wrong? Nothing. Oh, come on. Are you angry? No, it's just... I feel ashamed. What for? By failing to complete my task, I've let the order down. The Grandmaster, my comrades, and you. I've even raised the blade, uh, raised the blade you, sm you uh, smithed for me against you. You are being controlled by Providence. It's not your fault. It was because of my carelessness. No, it was uh, their twisted magic tricks, uh, that magic tricks that caused this. But now you're back, and that's what matters. We'll make them pay for what they did. You're right, thanks. It's getting late. Head back. Uh, let's head back. Of course. Liberation of Area, Chapter 3 complete. I'm so happy you unlocked fast travel too. Double-edged sword. New quests are available. See your quest log for details. I want to see what that achievement was. Complete chapter three. Oh, okay. It looks like there are six chapters in all. If that's um, anything to go by. So that's for the third district, the fourth district, and maybe the leader. Hmm. The level cap is fifty. Huh, interesting. Fully upgrade your weapons. I haven't done that yet. Oh, that looks like it might take a while. Read 30 books? <laughs> okay, fine. I just want to read through these real quick. Cook one of every fish. Attain every stave statue. I'm surprised there isn't a progress bar for that. View every memory dive. 
Unlock every location on the world map. Clear out the hidden province hideout. Where's that? Play for 10 hours. <laughs> Fine. Bought something from the black market. There's a black market? Repair the Saki stolen bridge. I'll build my own path. Won a high, won a high stakes gamble. Admired yourself. What if looking in a mirror, probably? Reach the safe statue in Kanoe Woods in the shortest path possible. Oh, interesting. 116th Kanoe. I love these names. Upgrade all the shops in the remnants of Area HQ completely. Uncover an ancient secret. Win every dive battle consecutively. What on earth is that? Obtain the ultimate armor. Obtain every other achievement. And... Wow, 40 achievements and all. That's not bad for a game like this. Now we know this. Okay. <clears throat> well, I think that's going to be it for now. Next time we might do some more side quests. I might play around a little more now that we actually have um, fast travel unlocked. Till then, I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.